Hey guys, what's up? So today, I'm gonna show you how to make origami dominoes. These are really simple, and then we have one sheet of paper, no tape, or glue. Let's get started. So, for the first step, you can either choose to skip it or leave it. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna fold this part up, but you don't have to. It's totally optional. That fold up is only for this to make it look clean. This this side right here, because it's not gonna be a raw edge. Which is gonna make it look really nice. Nice and even. So it doesn't really matter how much you fold up. And it doesn't matter if you do it at all. Totally optional. And since we want this, once you're done this, we want this to be seamless. So there's gonna be no folds on it. It looks very clean. We're going to, instead of folding this in half, we're going to make a mark. We're gonna make a, we're gonna only pinch the sides. Like that. And then we're going to fold this to the pinch. And we're going to fold this now. And then we can fold this in the middle as well. Like that. Now we can unfold. And notice how my my little fold here is on the top. We're going to fold this to that line. And then since this is the part that doesn't have this fold, we're going to fold this up one. Like that. Now we're going to do the same with this one, but we're going to do some extra, we're, we're going to do some extra folds. So we're going to fold to the second line right here. I'm not sure if you guys can see it nicely, but you should be able to see it really nicely on your paper. And before we fold here, let me just tell you we're not going to do that because we want we want this side to be the top, and we don't want a line in it. So we keep it like this. So what we're going to do is we're going to fold this corner that line. Uh, I can't even see it. There we go. And we'll do the same here. And then we're going to do the same here, but we're going to, not on the first one, on the second one. it like this and we're going to fold from here to here and you're gonna have to be very precise so do the best you can see how well I did mm, I did pretty nicely and we're gonna do the same here close this you can see that there's a gap here that should be around should be this much as much as how much you folded for the first step and then we're going to unfold so now that we have that what we're going to do is you see a square here 
I don't know, you can see it nicely. Let me just do some extra folding so you guys can see it nicely. You see this square? We're going to make an X in it. So we're, we're going to fold this up. And we're going to bring this, this edge. And we're going to fold that across right there. Like that. So then you have this right there. Then you're going to do the same here. Carefully, you're going to put it on like that. So now you have an X right there. We're going to do the same on this side. I'm just going to grab this, this side, make sure this is a mountain fold. And I'm just going to place it on that edge. Maybe bring it up, like flatten it. Like that. And then we're going to flatten it here as well. So now we're almost done. So we're gonna take the side that doesn't have this extra line and we're gonna fold this side up. Like that. All right, so now we're going to put the box together. And actually we're gonna do an, an ex some extra steps to make uh, everything nicer put together. So we're gonna uh, unfold that and we're going to Fold this triangle back like that. You can do the same on these. And we're going to do the same on this one. And finally, we're going to do this one right here. Now, now we're ready to put it back together. So we're gonna put that up. And then we're gonna kind of fold that, these parts in like that. And we're going to fold on there. So we have this kind of part sticking out. And we can do this. So we fold this and we Stick this in there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna fold this side up. So it's like this. Make sure that this part goes all the way into the back corner. And just fix mine up a bit. take some time so be patient. dominoes and use them for like building blocks I guess and just put it like this and stack them I don't know or like you can like use it as a gift box you know put your gifts inside give it to someone if you use bigger paper of course but yeah that's it thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed <laughs>